There were a few scattered snowflakes in Baldwin County today with the winter storm skirting most of the county. Let's go live to Debbie Williams. No major issues there, Debbie, but everybody is bracing for another cold night. Yes, they are. And, you know, we struggled to get out of the 20s for most of the day. Here in the sunshine, it's about 38, 39 degrees right now. That'll be dropping pretty quick once the sun goes down. But, you know, if it was a winter wonderland you were looking for, it was not in Baldwin County. What Mother Nature didn't do for Baldwin County, well, Randy Wilson did in his front yard, creating an ice sculpture with the help of his sprinkler and a pear tree. Ice was not an issue for roads and bridges. However, there was a flurry or two in the county. This video captured by Dean Mott in Baymanette around 9.30 this morning. Others to the west of us weren't as fortunate, though, and Baldwin County is coming to their aid, sending help from Baldwin EMC to help restore power in Taylorsville, Mississippi, where 16,000 are still without electricity after that storm packed a punch through there. And this is kind of a thank you from Baldwin County crews to those Mississippi crews because they were over here during Hurricane Sally. So just a little winter excitement for the folks in Baldwin County. And the folks that we talked to today, well, they said, that's enough. Live on the Baldwin County Beat in Foley, Debbie Williams, WKRG News 5.